to see you guys. Welcome to today's devotion. I want to be speaking out of 1 Corinthians chapter 15. So go ahead and pause this video and read 1 Corinthians chapter 15. Welcome back. I hope you read it. We are encouraging you guys to be reading your, reading your Bible every single day, to be in God's Word, to be in Scripture, to be letting that feed you and nourish you and allow you to continue to grow in your relationship with Christ during this season. There's a couple verses I want to pull out in particular and take a look at today. First one is chapter 15, verse 1. It says this, Now, brothers and sisters, I want to remind you of the gospel I preached to you, on which you receive and on which you have taken your stand. Paul then talks about what the gospel is and essentially referring to the resurrection of Jesus and how with his new life, we have new life. Listen to verses three and four. He says, for what I have received and passed on to you as of first importance, that Christ died for our sins according to the scriptures, the Old Testament, that he was buried and that he was raised on the third day according to the scriptures. Now, can you imagine being one of those disciples that Jesus appeared to in the final days when he was back to life and walking around on earth? How pumped would you be to see the resurrected Jesus? And how much would that change your life? Well, I wanna encourage you guys, just as Paul says, be reminded of the gospel. Be reminded of the resurrection. You see, we celebrated that yesterday for Easter, but check it out, Easter is a holiday celebration. But the resurrection is an everyday celebration. We can celebrate the gospel and live that out every day. So I want to encourage you guys, be reminded of the gospel and of the resurrection of Jesus. Let that be what you live your life by. Let that inform every day your decisions and your actions in your relationships. So go ahead and be thinking about that and spend some time thinking about that today on how you can be reminded in your life of the gospel and the resurrection of Jesus. Love you guys. Have a great week.